The headline of the New York Times announced the arrival of the Pierre Hotel as an event of considerable importance. It would rise for 41 stories at Fifth Avenue and 61st Street. The atmosphere would be that of an exclusive private club, simple and elegant. The consulting chef was Auguste Escoffier, and the big money behind the project came from E.F. Hutton and Walter Chrysler. A guidebook at the time described it as a monument of beauty and one of the most majestic structures in all of New York. Only one problem. It opened up in 1930, which was also opening day for the Great Depression. So the hotel, along with everything and everybody else, fell on our times. However, in 1938, the hotel was purchased by John Paul Getty, who had made a few bucks as the head of the Standard Oil Company, and things began to look up. The Pierre was back. In 1950, it was the first hotel to install radio and television sets in all its guest rooms. In 2005, it was taken over by Taj Hotels, Resorts and Palaces. Now, I've seen a lot of hotel groups offering hotels, resorts and spas, but this is the first time I have ever heard of a group offering palaces. I like it. Say you've been living in your family palace five, six hundred years. Enough is enough. You want out, but you're into sustainable business practices and you want to do the right thing. So you call up the Taj Hotel Group and they turn it into a great hotel. They did it for the Taj Mahal Palace in Mumbai, which had the city's first licensed bar when it opened in 1903. The Taj Group has been around for over a century and they run over a hundred properties. And wherever they go, they bring great works of art from Indian artists. They certainly did a good job with the Pierre. In 2010, they celebrated the hotel's 80th birthday. Just between you and me, she doesn't look a day over 38. The Tui Lounge has a typical English tea service. It's called the Tui because it's at 2 East 61st Street. Very logical. The rotunda is painted to look like Versailles before the revolution. They have a Jaguar house car that is available to all guests on a first come first serve basis. It will take you anywhere you'd like to go in Manhattan, or you can just sit in the back and feel rich. Artisans from Portugal who specialized in historic restorations hand painted the ceilings of the Grand Ballroom. The hotel has special services for children, so we thought somebody young enough to truly appreciate it should explain it. Did you get a little book about penguins? Uh, penguins, a, a stuffed penguin, and a movie about penguins. I watched it, it was pretty good. And also you get a little rocking tiger, and some chocolate and candy. I also have a program for pampered pups. In the 21st century, hotels have to offer things that they never offered before. And the quality of those things really affects the quality of your life while you're in the hotel. And one of them is an absolutely fantastic IT guy. Raja, here's my problem. <laughs> when I go to here and I go to there, I run into a problem. What should I do? Okay, so now we can go. Right. Open the email. It's open. It's, it says it's already has. So Replace. It. Got it. Ah, life in the 21st century. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you.